guys, I'm Jess, and today on Bpop, I'm going to try out some new face masks from Amazon. This company actually contacted me and asked me to try out some sheet masks, and I was like, um, sure, I'll try out sheet masks. We're going to try one out in this video, and I already washed my face and stuff, and I have this awesome headband from Forever 21 that's keeping my hair in place. So let's do this. First, I'm going to show you all the sheet masks you get for $10.99. You get 12 sheet masks. I thought that was an awesome deal. So I was like all about that. The brand is Lost Tuki. I don't know. I'm probably butchering that. You guys know I butcher everyone's name. So <laughs> that's what it is. This one is Red Wine. And this one is a cream mask. I've never tried a cream mask. So I'm really excited for that. Then we have Cucumber. It's an essence mask. I like cucumber. I especially like avocado, which is another cream mask. How long do you leave these on? Ooh, they're three layer sheet masks. And how long? Gently cleanse, tone the skin, place a mask on the face, leave on for 15 to 20 minutes, and then discard the mask. Softly massage essence into skin. Okay. There's actually directions on the back that are in English, so that's very helpful. This one's honey. Ooh. And it is another essence mask. Then we have blackberry. That one's probably gonna smell really good. And it is a cream mask. Lemon. Lemon. I like the packaging on these, they're very vibrant. Seaweed. Pomegranate. Ooh. Um, broccoli. Who doesn't love some broccoli? Green tea, rose, is this a, is another essence mask, and rice. So I'm trying to figure out which one I want to put on my face. It's kind of a toss up between the rice and the um, red wine because I've never tried a red wine mask. I've never tried a rice mask. I think I'm going to go for the red wine because I feel like this is the one I'm probably going to like the least because I don't really like red wine in general so I just want to see like how it smells how it is and it's also a cream mask and I really want to try one of those we're going to go for the red wine one <laughs> let's see how this goes I probably should have brought a towel with me or something I didn't like I said my face is already clean the red wine mask is for brightening and shine I mean who couldn't use some brightening in their lives again leave on for 15 to 20 minutes hi muffin what are you doing so that's the front and this is the back. Let's rip this guy open. It doesn't smell like red wine, so that's like already good <laughs> for me at least. Hmm, it smells really, really good. And it, it, it does feel a lot thicker than a normal sheet mask. Cause normally I have trouble like opening them I'm gonna look like a serial killer. It smells really good. I don't know what scent it is, but it's like kind of sweet. Let's put it on my face. So cold. Instant serial killer. I can't really move my face. So I'm gonna leave this on for 15 to 20 minutes and I'll be back. Ugh, that bit isn't staying on that well. There we go. So it's been 15 minutes and the only issue I've really had with this face mask sticking to my face is like on my chin area. It doesn't seem to wanna stick that well, but up on my forehead and on my cheeks it's like sticking really well. It might just be because it is thicker than a normal sheet mask, I would say. But other than that, I haven't had any issues with it. So let's go ahead and take this off. My eyebrows look crazy. Let's just zoom in so you can see this. It's pretty moisturized, I would say. I do look more awake. Um, I don't look as dead as I did earlier, but I'm just going to go ahead and massage this in. It doesn't feel itchy or irritating to my skin. I do have pretty sensitive skin and my skin I would say is pretty normal. So like when it's super hot out, it might be just a little oily or if it's super cold out, I might get like a little 
dry patches, but other than that, like, my skin is pretty fine. I do have some acne. Like, I have this one that randomly popped up. Ugh. But other than that, I don't get a whole lot of acne anymore. Thank the gods. Let's just go ahead and massage this in and let it dry. My eyebrows look intense. That's what my face looks like after the face mask. It was very comfortable and it was very like soaked in serum. Like I feel like there was a lot of serum on there, but it wasn't like dripping off. I hate it whenever you take the mask out of the bag and it's just like dripping serum stuff everywhere. And I'm like, no, I want that on my face. So yeah, that is my demo and review of these sheet masks from Les Tookie. I am so butchering that, I know, but I'm gonna leave a link down below because that's easy. I'm gonna do that and I think it's a great deal. You get a lot of masks. I will definitely be using the rest of these masks. I can't wait to try it, especially the avocado one because I love avocado. But yeah, if you guys want to check these out for yourself, there will be a link down in the description so you can do so. If you like face masks, sheet mask videos, make sure and give this video a big thumbs up. And while you're down there, hit that notification bell so you're notified every single time I upload a new video. You can find me here on social media. And check back every Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday for new videos and click that button below to subscribe. Bye guys, thanks for watching.